Hi, it's Roger here with another episode of Entrepreneur TV. A special episode, because I said in my last episode I would be sharing the video that Luke, my son, has put together for his Indiegogo campaign. So that's coming up right now. Uh, watch the video, enjoy it, uh, leave a note down below. Go support the campaign. It's all about something called the Fibonacci Blocks, which is all about learning through doing. Um, I believe, as I'm sure you do as well, that kids of today, there's a whole different way for us to get educated, for us to appreciate history, appreciate maths, appreciate design. That's what the Fibonacci Blocks are all about. They're about how you can go about learning through doing to change the way you see the world. Uh, I hope you enjoy it and uh, go support it. And I will keep you updated as to how it goes in the weeks ahead. Have you ever wondered how artists and architects created so much beauty throughout history? Would you like to play using the same natural proportions as Michelangelo and Leonardo da Vinci? Now you can, by helping me create the Fibonacci blocks. These blocks are designed using the golden ratio. This is a natural proportion found in works of art from the pyramids to the Taj Mahal. My name is Luke Hamilton. I'm a 16-year-old student in Bali, and I created the Fibonacci blocks as my grade 10 personal project. I was inspired by Friedrich Froebel. He invented kindergarten and inspired educators like Montessori and Steiner to help children learn through play. He created the Froebel blocks to help children think in three dimensions. Many famous scientists, artists, and architects used his blocks when they were children. People like Albert Einstein, Buckminster Fuller, Frank Lloyd Wright, and Paul Clay. So I created the Fibonacci blocks. They use measurements that match the Fibonacci series, creating the golden spiral and golden section. When you divide the long side by the short side of each golden section, you get a proportion called phi, which Leonardo da Vinci called the golden proportion. Scientists and artists through history have found this proportion in nature and in our bodies. With the help of Balinese craftsmen, I created my first set. The children at my school loved playing with them, and they began creating amazing structures and patterns immediately. Actually, so did the adults. Then, the Ivy magazine featured me, Richard Branson got a set on Necker Island, and many people wanted to buy a set. So I need your help. I have worked out that with your support, we can produce the blocks with a team of Balinese craftsmen friends and family. By supporting this campaign, you can help children and adults around the world to discover their natural genius with the Fibonacci blocks. You will also be helping the environment as we're making the blocks from sustainable wood grown in Bali and I'm giving 10% of all profits to the Rainforest Alliance to help save the rainforests. My dream is that a simple product like the Fibonacci blocks can go a small way to make a big difference in the way we see the world and shape the world. Please help me make my dream come true.